welcome to today's vlog. I just noticed that my sweatshirt and my makeup bag are literally the same shade. So that's funny. But today is Wednesday the 23rd and it's currently 6.10 right now. I'm getting ready for dinner. Me and my best friend are going to go to this place where we like to go shoot pool, have a couple of drinks, and they also have really good food. So we're gonna go there. Um, it's like one of our favorite spots in Greensboro to go. Just really chill vibes, that's why I'm wearing a cropped sweatshirt. I'll show you guys my outfit later. But um, yeah, you guys saw me get ready for the night. I did a face mask, brushed my teeth again. Um, I took a shower and did my hair, which honestly needs to be reevaluated at this point. Like, it is not cute, but we're working with it. But I don't feel the most confident right now. That's why I'm literally wearing a sweatshirt. Uh, because I am ghostly pale. So, I haven't been this pale in a really long time. So, I need something to, like, go higher up on the neck. Because my foundation is going to be, like, way too dark. But, anyway, I haven't vlogged in a really long time. So, I thought that I would just pick up a camera and vlog. I honestly don't even know what I'm necessarily doing tomorrow. <laughs> um, so we'll see how this goes. It's gonna be a really chill vlog. Yeah, nothing really much to say. I think I'm gonna end this vlog on Friday um, because Saturday is my best friend Joe's birthday and we have like plans for that. It's gonna be really fun. And so I obviously don't wanna vlog on her birthday because we're doing like a whole pre-game dinner situation and then like going out that night. So yeah, I don't wanna be like focusing on vlogging. So I'll probably just vlog tonight, tomorrow, and then Friday. I missed my upload last Sunday, um, which I never do. I had filmed literally a whole vlog and I had like so much footage, but I edited the whole thing and ended up hating it. Um, I don't know. So I just decided not to upload it. Ah, <sighs> but yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. Look, literally look, this is my situation right now. Yeah, so I'm gonna do my makeup and I'm gonna fast forward through all this because I wanna be able to listen to music and not copyrighted. This literally looks so bad. Like this color normally matches me in the summer or like when I'm spray tan. So yeah, it'll come together. With the makeup you guys are really high up right now because of uh my little light that i have it's hard to balance it on top of my viewfinder so i just decided to set my camera on top of the light instead of having the light on the camera anyways this is the makeup i just did really like soft glam like natural i used all cream products no powder yeah it's the makeup i need to do something with my hair because i do not like it at all. I'm watching Inventing Anna. It's pretty good. It's all right. Here's my outfit. So I'm wearing the All Yours little cropped hoodie in Sonic Pink from Lulu and then my Align joggers from Lulu. Love them. And then my new Golden Gooses. Really cute. So that's the fit. I just got home. Yeah, I just got home. Uh, Michaela was gonna stay the night, depending on how much she drank, but we Ubered there and back, and she only had one drink, and like I had two, and we were completely fine. But um, yeah, it was really fun. We were there from like 8, what was it, like 8.30? 8. 
to now and we just sat and ate and then played pool for a little bit. It was pretty fun. But I got these like spicy chicken tenders that I normally get from there and it was like spicy barbecue and y'all they were literally so spicy and they hurt my stomach so bad my stomach was cramping i felt so bloated yeah normally they don't do that though so i don't know why they did that tonight but y'all saw how i curled my hair right and that was completely straight so that's kind of funny i do have a busy day tomorrow i'm gonna try and work out i haven't booked orange theory yet i was gonna wait and see like how much i drank tonight um to see if i wanted to do like an earlier morning one or like afternoon oh they don't even have a 9 45 so i'm not gonna do that so i could do 12 or 3 I might do it at three o'clock. Okay, I just signed up. So, that's on the agenda. I'm just gonna get ready for bed. I'm gonna take my makeup off and maybe watch a little bit of Netflix of the um, Inventing Anna, I think is a move. Shoot, totally forgot. My pill organizer is empty for nighttime. So, I'm gonna have to do that, but I'm not gonna do that tonight. I'm gonna do it tomorrow. All right, I'm gonna end off the vlog tonight. I will see you guys tomorrow. I know I didn't get a lot of footage today, but it's quite frankly because I started the vlog so late in the day because <laughs> I didn't know I was gonna vlog until later. But yeah, all right, I'll talk to you guys in the morning. to the kitchen made my coffee and then i've got these new um i almost called them athletic greens because that's another brand of greens that a lot of influencers use but these are the one-up nutrition greens my youtube friend cameron jewel drinks these and so she inspired me so i've been doing it the past couple of days and i've been meaning to order a milk frother little individual tool thing because i had one a while ago and then i got my espresso and got rid of it but I need one for this because it's just not like there's chunks and it's just not the move, you know? Yeah, so uh, it's currently Thursday. I look really rough. I'm not though. Like I literally <laughs> feel fine. I had two drinks last night. I'm not hungover or anything. I wasn't even drunk. But um, it's really cloudy outside. That's why I have my little ring light. <laughs> so if it's kind of dramatic, that's why. But I got a notification today on YouTube saying that somebody noticed that the last few videos of mine have been like lower resolution and like just overall blurrier. And I had noticed that too, but I tried to fix it and I didn't know how. So I'm gonna be working on that today because I don't like that my videos have gotten blurry. I don't know what's going on. And I hope to God that this one's not blurry. And it probably is, so now I'm freaking out. Every morning I put on my Barefoot Dreams little robe because it feels like a blanket is wrapped around me and for the longest time i like stopped using this and i would just use my barefoot dreams blankets and then i'm like why because this is a literal this is the same thing you know also i have pimple patches all over my face and i didn't even realize that so. also you guys i literally have all my blinds open and it's still like really cloudy i woke up like two or three times in the middle of the night oh my God, i literally i can't i look so tragic i woke up like two or three times my stomach was hurting so bad sharp pain hurting so bad and i was freaking out like at one point i like tried to move and i couldn't it's like that's weird i have no idea why i guess from the spicy tenders oh i need to get my ice roller oh it's so cold I'm supposed to have class today because it's Thursday. I have class at 2, but I'm not going because my professor said on Tuesday that today our lecture would only be 30 minutes, and usually it's an hour and 15, right, or longer. 
Yeah, hour and 15. What the heck? She said that today our lecture would only be 30 minutes and then she'd give us time to work on a group project that's due the 15th of March. So, and my group already finished it. So, well, I finished my parts. I think we're just waiting on like one other person's parts, but. So it's like already finished, so I'm not even going. I have like bags under my eyes, you guys. But yeah, so I decided to go to Orange Theory instead because I like to go at least three times a week. I try to go more, but all right, I'm gonna sit and maybe watch some YouTube or some Netflix. So I decided to get some groceries delivered. There's literally a grocery store right next to me, but I don't like that one necessarily. Like I just go there if like it's an emergency and I need to grab something. Like if I'm making dinner that night and just need to go get some ingredients like the day of I'll go to it but I typically only go to Fresh Market, Trader Joe's occasionally and Whole Foods so there's also Whole Foods next to me so I could also go there but I don't know I just like getting it delivered because it's so much easier and it's not that much more it's like $10 more and then plus tip so I'm gonna get these delivered but I have a dilemma because I'm doing Orange Theory at 3 um, because I don't know, I just decided to do it at three because there wasn't a 945 class, which is what I normally like to do. So the delivery options were like two to four and I'll be gone and I have to be there for the delivery because I got some wine. So it was like two to four and then four to six, which also I might not be home. Like my workout gets done at four. So I'm like literally going to have to rush home or it was six to eight. And so I just did the four to six. So wish me luck, but I just got some celery sticks, bottles of wine, some peppers, um, some like jalapeno chips, two bananas, baby carrots, cliff bars, turkey breast, two avocados, mozzarella, sourdough bread, chicken, and like toilet paper because I'm literally out. Yay. Bag finally secured. You guys have no idea how long I've been waiting on this dang order. I placed the order at like 11.30 on Uber Eats for Panera, cause it sounded good, rainy day vibes. And I was literally waiting for an hour and like 15 minutes. Um, it said the delivery person had zero deliveries and she was literally sitting like in a random parking lot, not even close to Panera. And this was like an hour after I'd placed the order. And I was like, what the heck? So then I like reached out to customer service. They were like, we haven't even contacted or we haven't even connected you with the driver yet. And so then I was like, okay. And I kept waiting for like another 20 minutes. And then I just canceled the order and they refunded me because it was obviously their fault. So then I used DoorDash and I swear on my life, I literally got it right when they promised me to the exact minute that they promised me. So it took like another 15 20 minutes but at least i have it so i got a half turkey sandwich and usually i get mozzarella on it but i have to add my own because it wasn't an option on doordash but on uber eats i could and then i also got like a little mini greek salad and i add mozzarella to that and then i got chicken noodle soup because i like to dip my sandwich in it i don't know i'm weird but all right i'm literally gonna shove this down my throat because i'm so hungry i've been editing the past couple of hours and yeah, that's it. That's the tea. All right, guys. So I started getting ready. I just put this little set on from Lulu. I'll show you guys in the full mirror, but it's the Maldives Green Energy Long Line and then the, I think, Wonder Train. So, yeah. But yeah, um, I forgot that I had a Lulu package that I grabbed last night. That I haven't showed you guys, so I'm going to open it. And then I also have another one that was just delivered. So I'll get that when I go to Orange Theory, cause obviously I have to go, I have to pass the mail room on the way to my car. So I'll just grab it then, but I'm so excited. First thing that I got, it also just started raining, which is not motivating me to work out. And I literally have no energy. <laughs> like, I don't know what's wrong with me. And I'm super bloated from whatever was going on with my stomach. Like it hurts so bad, but Hopefully running will help it. But I just got the Align High Rise Short 6 inch in Blue Nile in a size 2. I'm so, so excited to wear these like in the spring and summer. I think it would look so, so cute. I love this color, you guys know. So I'm excited about that. I haven't mentioned any of this obviously in a Lulu haul yet, um, but I will. 
you guys are just getting a sneak peek. Then I also got this cross chill jacket. It's got the breathable repel shell fabric. It's windproof, waterproof, four-way stretch. It's got a sensual hood. I don't know, I needed a rain jacket and I saw my YouTube friend Cameron Jewel talk about this one and I loved the contrast of the black and white. So I think I'm gonna wear this today because it's cl clearly raining is what I was trying to say before my battery died. Ooh, uh, I got it in a size four. I don't know if I said that. I like it. You know, like when you wear a rain jacket without like short sleeves, without short sleeves, without long sleeves, like, and the feeling of the rain jacket is just like so uncomfortable on your skin. This one doesn't feel like that, like, which I love because I obviously like wear tank tops and sports bras to work out in. And whenever I'd wear my other rain jacket, it would be so uncomfortable, but this one's like a nice fleece. So this is what it looks like. I love it. My hair is so dirty, but I'm getting a spray tan tonight for the weekend. So I'm just gonna wash it tomorrow probably. Oh, there's an ice cream on the floor. <laughs> oh, oh my God. Oh, that was really loud. Okay, so it is 2.40 right now. I'm about to leave. I'm gonna be early though. Maybe I'll grab my package when I head down there, but I'm actually taking my mom's car. <laughs> Um, funny story, but basically my parents have been in Wyoming for the past two weeks, maybe two and a half. And so I needed to borrow her car. It was this whole thing. My car needed to get an oil change. And then they told me I need new tires, like really bad. I haven't been driving my car that much. Only when I really need to park in my school's parking garage because it's just really like tight spaces and I don't like taking her car because it's a little bit bigger. So yeah, I've been driving her car for the most part. That way I don't wear my tires down even more. And when they get back from Wyoming, well actually we're all flying back together because I'm going with them. But um, when we get back from Wyoming, I guess my dad will take it and get new tires put on. So yeah, so if you guys see me in a different car, it's, it's my mom's car, but Anyways, I'm heading out. I'm out of breath. This is bad. Like, am I okay? Um, I don't know. I've been like really low energy today, but could be my period. Also, I'm in the process of buying a new camera because I was looking back on this footage. Like I've been editing this vlog all day and like, it's just, I don't know. Something's going on. I tried to even clean my camera lens. I'm not sure, but I'm over it. Like I want best quality you know so i think i'm gonna bite the bullet i found this canon camera on best buy i found a case for it i found a little bag i found a mic i think i'm just gonna bite the bullet and do it um so i think we're gonna do that when i get back yeah also i'm gonna take oh no. this hook literally just came off the wall okay there we go <laughs> got my keys and my little bag now we're about to head out so I guess I'll see you guys after Orange Theory or I might vlog a little in the car, I'm not sure yet. I'm really hoping that my camera doesn't fall. Okay. Um, I love my mom's car literally so much. It's a BMW X5, I believe. Okay, this camera situation's not working out. <laughs> I used to have a BMW X3 and I liked it a lot. It was an older one and then it got totaled in a flood at my old apartment building. If you know, you know, and you're an O freaking G. So yeah, that was unfortunate. I was supposed to have that car until I graduated college, but then the flood happened. So, so yeah, but um, I really like my mom's car and it makes me want to get a BMW, but I don't know. I don't know if I should really like it though it's so nice and it drives so smooth it drives better than my mercedes which is odd but um okay i am like four minutes away from orange theory so i will talk to you guys after my workout i'm rushing home it's 359 i'm literally i got out of class at 357 and i'm turning into my apartment it's only like a four three to four minute drive depending on which way i go and how bad traffic is but i'm rushing back because of the delivery people and like i can't miss them so yeah but oh my god that was incredibly hard it was a esp day which if you guys don't go to orange theory means endurance strength and power and usually each day at orange theory is a different one of those so 
Like one day it'll be endurance, one day it'll be strength, one day it'll be power. So it was all three of those. So it was incredibly difficult. But all is well. I just walked in the door. I'm trying to fix my camera. I just got a notification from Whole Foods saying that my order will be delivered soon. So it should be here in the next five minutes, I'd say. So I'm gonna do a Lululemon haul. I think this is just one item, but I don't even know which one it is. Um, and then I have two more orders on the way and they're supposed to be here next week. So when those get here, I'm gonna film on those. I just got the Edge Street tank, the Racerback crop tank in a size four in the creamy mint color. I'm not like obsessed with this color, but I think it'd be cute with some like white shorts or like a white pace rival skirt maybe. I don't know, it's a really fun it's springy color, but hopefully it looks good on me. So that's all I got in that order. I think I'm supposed to get something else tomorrow. Guys, I just spent a fortune on this new camera. And, and, and I paid for next day shipping AM delivery. First I was gonna do the three day delivery, which was like $18 extra. And then I was like, ooh, I don't even know the other options, but there were like four shipping options and I chose the most expensive one. Um, but it'll be here tomorrow morning, hopefully. If not, then I guess Saturday. I don't know, depending on the carrier, but holy crap. But I'm like, I've been so self-conscious about my videos recently because of the quality. And that's why I didn't post my vlog that was supposed to go up last Sunday because it was so out of focus. And I don't know why. I got a mic, I got a bag. I was gonna get like a little pink case like I have for my camera now, but it's white. So I don't know, we'll see how I like the white, but I love my pink camera, but yeah. Super excited, so glad that I'm about to have really great quality videos and I'm just so grateful that I was able to buy that, you know, like I love you guys so much. And I'm so grateful for every single one of you that watch my videos and I want to make sure that my videos are, you know, really good quality and not crappy quality. So yeah, I'm very excited, but I gotta go put my groceries away. I already showed you guys what I got. So I might still do like a little grocery haul though. I preheat the oven to 450. Oh, what did I do? I think I did 455. Because I'm gonna do a pizza. I'll show you guys which one. It's the Amy's Margarita Pizza. Can you guys tell I'm obsessed with mozzarella? Like I am, it's the best cheese. I'm sorry, like I'm right. And then I'm gonna have it with the salad from Panera and I added mozzarella cheese in it earlier. Looks really good. I might pour a glass of wine. Should I do that? I don't know. I kind of really actually want to try this wine. I have been editing for the past hour or so and caught up on this vlog. So 6.03, I'm about to hop in the shower while that's preheating because I just got to rinse off. And I'm gonna shower, then I'm gonna eat dinner and then I'm gonna go get a spray tan later. I'm not gonna have a hefty glass of wine since I do have to drive. Even though I could literally walk to my spread tan place. <sighs> but yeah, it's just gonna be a chill night. Okay, so I just got out of the shower. I ended up putting um, the pizza in before I got in the shower. That way it'd be done when I got out, but it's not done, it has four minutes left. But I'm eating my salad. So freaking good, it's just the Greek salad from Panera and I added mozzarella. If I order it like at Panera, I always get them to just add the mozzarella. Instead, I think it comes with feta, but I just had to add it myself this time, it's fine. But I was just thinking like, why do like restaurant salads taste way better than like you making your own? Because like last week 
I made a fresh homemade salad. I mean, I literally bought the head of lettuce, had to soak it and wash it, let it crisp in the fridge, chop it up, chop up the tomatoes, chop up the cucumbers, add the mozzarella in. I added like apple chips and I had to add my own dressing. And like I did it from scratch and this one's still better. <laughs> like how? Let me know if you guys can relate. Also, I'm just now realizing that I had mozzarella in the salad, I'm having mozzarella in the pizza, and I had mozzarella on my sandwich today. Am I okay? Guys, wait, look at this. Okay, so I'm on the Philips Hue app because all my lights in my apartment are Philips Hue brand because they connect with my Alexa. But uh, you can do like a candle effect and it's like flickering. How freaking cool. Good morning, everybody. Ignore my appearance. I have not showered my spray tan off yet because I've been waiting on my freaking package to get here all day. I woke up at eight o'clock. In the morning so just for context i basically had to cancel my orange theory class that morning because fedex said that they were going to require a signature upon delivery for my camera that i overnighted so i had to cancel because it promised it would be here before 12. that didn't even end up happening but yeah that's just a little context i forgot to mention because fedex starts deliveries at 8 and it said my camera would be here by 12. So I literally woke up at eight, I went back to sleep and I kept like checking the tracking for an update and I ended up sleeping till like 9, 30, 10. It didn't make it before 12. I just got a notification that it's here but I haven't gotten a code to go pick it up yet. But I got an Ulta package, I got a Lulu package, I got another package and I think I have like two or three Amazon packages that I have to go get. I just got my package notification and I'm about to go down there and get it but i thought that i would unbox my ulta package first yeah i literally haven't showered or done anything because I'm, i was afraid of missing the knock at my door they didn't even need a signature so i'm kind of irritated because i put my whole day on hold for the stupid signature that i didn't even need i got a five pack of the loop night shift face mask i got the variety pack from revolve and the night ones are my favorite because I love doing face masks at night. But in this vlog, I did use the um, girls night out one or like night out one. And I liked that one a lot. I've used the, I think I've used four out of five of the variety pack. The only one I haven't used is the morning one. But I know that these are my favorite. So I just got them. I just got them. Okay. I'm going to go change the battery real quick. And then I'm going to go get my freaking camera. So I just got back from the mail room. Okay, so from Amazon. Oh, my milk frother that I literally ordered yesterday. I just got it in this pink one for my greens. Guys, I kid you freaking not. I was literally about to unbox my new camera and now this one's not working at all. Like if anybody knows how to fix this, like please let me know. I've tried different like settings. I tried switching batteries. Don't know what it is, but wow that's crazy i just got chick-fil-a i was editing a little bit i've been setting up my new camera here's the camera bag that i got my new camera's charging right now um i've got it plugged in over here so hopefully that'll be done soon but i'll show you guys my new camera here's the new setup i just added this little mic it's the canon eos m50 mark ii came with this zoom lens which i'm really excited about i have the cap on it just so it doesn't scratch the viewfinder's different though so that's gonna throw me off because normally the viewfinder's on top for my camera that i have now so that's gonna throw me off but i can't wait till it's charged so that i can test it out but it's five o'clock right now though or 4.45 actually. And I am going out tonight with my best friend Joe and 
one of her friends and we're gonna go out in Winston. Normally we go out in Greensboro. Tomorrow we're going out in Greensboro because it's Joe's birthday. So we're going to a really nice restaurant, Green Valley Grill, and then we're gonna pregame a little bit and then go out. So it'll be really, really fun. But I'm not gonna vlog that because I have to edit this tomorrow morning to go up for you guys on Sunday. But I just got Chick-fil-A because I'm ashamed to say that the only thing I've ate today was a cliff bar. I don't know why I have groceries, but I didn't really feel like cooking and I need to eat something kind of like filling when I'm drinking. That's my number one rule is if I'm gonna drink, I have to eat a good meal. I load up on carbs. And then the day after drinking, I load up on carbs. That's my number one like hack. But I just get nuggets and fries. And then I got a Coke or Dr. Pepper. I'm waiting until my camera charges. Next clip you guys see will be on the new camera. So here's this quality now, the sound, quality, everything. Even though the quality is looking a little bit better today. That's weird. And then for the new camera, quality. Okay, this is my like fourth time trying this out. The camera's working, but I'm not sure if the mic's working. I've literally tried it like three or four times. So fingers crossed, I might, I think I like plugged it in wrong. So this is just a test. Hopefully it sounds amazing. So guys, I'm gonna have to get used to looking at the camera and not the viewfinder because this viewfinder is on the side and on my old camera, it's on the top. But I just finished getting ready. Um, I'll show you guys my outfit. It's really cute and my makeup, but this lighting is not doing it justice. I gotta do my lip. Um, but I ate Chick-fil-A earlier, but that was at like five. So I just made some tortellini so I'm eating that because like I have to eat. Joe is on her way. I feel so ugly without lip stuff on. Here is the outfit. The boobs are a lot, so I'm gonna keep my hair in front. And then just jeans and then probably my black golden gooses that I wore the other night. But these jeans make my butt look super good. And this top makes my boobs look super good. So I'm feeling super confident tonight i feel like this camera quality like it's really good but i look better in person um i don't know maybe i'll look back at the footage and be like i was wrong oh hold on hello sorry that was g um i'm using pillow talk no i'm just kidding i'm using charlotte tilbury super size me lip liner oh my gosh guys i'm literally gonna have to like put the viewfinder behind the camera or else i'm gonna keep looking at myself um i'm trying not to overline my lips because i've noticed that like if I overline it, it makes my mouth look too wide. I like big lips, but like, I feel like my face is, I've got really small features. It just makes it look weird, you know? This is not even at all. This is, I did exactly what I was trying not to do. Okay, that's better, I guess. Then I'm gonna throw Dior lip oil in 007. And that's the look. 